Seahawks Brock now with a game that is it's not it's must win. They must gotta win, win out. You gotta win out playoffs. if you wanna go to the playoffs. They are in the playoffs as far as I'm concerned right now. So who's got a man up this week? How about a couple of redheads? Starting on the left side of the offensive line, Paul McQuiston or McQuiston, as Pete Carroll called him on Tuesday. He got a heck of a task ahead of him. He has been my backup right guard <laughs> who now has to go to left tackle and deal with Julius Peppers. And you go on the road, that field, those conditions, the noise even for veteran left tackles to try to block off of the edge with that crowd noise in Chicago with a fan base that knows what's on the line for them as well, that's going to be a very, very daunting challenge. And the better he can do, that means the less Zach Miller has to help him, the yeah. less you have to chip over there, the less you know opportunity where all but, resources have to be on that side, and you can actually hopefully function as an offense. Doesn't a running game help him a lot too, though? If they're able to establish that running game with Marshawn Lynch running downhill, keeping that pass rush off balance, I would think that would help a lot. The second guy that also needs to step up, the second redhead, is John Ryan. Because Herm Edwards told us, Brock, you got a major difficulty on your hands or foot every time you got to decide what to do with Devin Hester. And Chicago scored six and a half points a game over the last two. They've been woeful there. They're without their running back, without their quarterback. Their game changer is Devin Hester. So, John Ryan, you cannot have any line drives. You cannot do that on Sunday. You've got a directional kick very well. you got to have hang time. And at, and at certain points, depending on how the game goes, just kick it out of bounds. Don't even give him a chance. So, two big redheads. Big time on the line. they got to man up. Redheads must man up on Sunday. That, of course, brought to you by Miller Lite. Man up. Choose a light beer that tastes like a beer. Ginger's on the loose.